Hello. We were so excited when Dolores asked us to speak today, Children's Day, because our children and the amazing children's ministry here are one of the big reasons why we're at South Maine. We started coming here about three and a half years ago when our oldest was two months old. We weren't looking for a new church home at the time, but we were running late to our church all the way across town, so we stopped in for a visit. <laughs> We were welcomed immediately. We loved the sermons, and we stayed for lunch several times. Um, we met Kyle and Kelly Barsh at FPU, who are amazing ambassadors for the church here, and we became very good friends with them, so we love them tremendously. Uh, Steve talked a few weeks ago about family and the litany of family welcome, in which we pledge to be a family of God for you in this place. We don't just hear those words as part of our Sunday church service. We feel them in every interaction here at the church. Um, with the Barshes, the Raiders, the Moors, and Tulik, and so many others who are our new family and our children's family here. We visited because of our, the close proximity to our home, and we returned because we were welcome. We stay here because this is where we want our children to grow up. And our children, you know, they reaffirm our faith in God many, many times a day. And I'm truly thankful that Valerie and I share the joy of parenthood together. This totally sounds scripted because it is, but... <laughs> <laughs> Raising our children in a church home, not only as they grow, but as, as she and I uh, grow as well. And you walk around here and people are just, C come here, let me love you. And it's just, <laughs> that's a really good feeling. So, you know, when, when it's said here in a few minutes, a family of God for you in this place. You know, we feel that all the way, you know, deep in our hearts and soul. So, We're taking a month to think about sharing. Surely there's somebody in your circle of influence who needs a family of God. Surely there's somebody that you could bring to this place and tell them every week, I gather to a, with a group of people who are otherwise strangers, who through the love of Christ Jesus have become brothers and sisters. It makes all the difference in my life, and if you'll let it, it will in yours. Thank you. 